Good evening. Welcome to the 2024 Prom Fashion Show. Proceeds from this evening's event are used to defray the costs of the senior prom and project graduation, which is an alcohol and drug-free celebration the senior, that the seniors participate in after graduation. Doreen Pitt and I are the chairpersons of the Prom Fashion Show this year, and before we get started, I did want to... <laughs> And before I get started, there are a handful of people that we'd like to thank. Starting off with our solicitors and basket wrappers, Elisa Rowland, Jean Kingsley, who can't be here tonight, and Judy Wargaski. Begging for donations is no small task. It's not fun. And there's just a lot of great baskets back there tonight that we'll be raffling off throughout the evening. So thanks for your efforts, for gathering the tricky tray items and making them look so beautiful. Thanks. Tracy Gardner was in charge of getting 24 boys to Adam's Fine Clothing and Tuxedo twice in two weeks. Not a small feat, uh, but she made it look easy and the boys look great tonight. And Doreen, I, I think, had a slightly more complicated task tonight. She had to source the gowns for the girls to wear then get all the girls to her house to try on and to figure out what size and what style and color all worked. Um, but she got everyone fitted and they looked sensational today. And just want to also thank David's Bridals and Wachung for a couple of additional dresses that we needed for tonight's show. Uh, the girls all look stunning. We did have a lot of help today getting the cafeteria set up for tonight's event and just you'll see a lot of workers today working the event. Too many to list, but I do want to thank you all and I really do appreciate you making this event a success. I'd also like to thank the GL administration who helped throughout the planning process of this event. That includes Mr. Nixon, Ms. Gillick, Ms. Toprek, Mr. Voorhees, and Mr. Marin and his custodial crew. Thanks also to the senior advisors, Mrs. Mazzaferro and Ms. Ranitz for being the liaison between Doreen and I and the student council to prepare for this event. We did print out programs tonight. Please take a look at it because there are dozens and dozens of families who made donations to the Tricky Tray and we want to thank you for that. There were some Amazon deliveries to my house that did not have a packing slip, so your name might not be in the program if you donated and it was an accident, not intentional, obviously. And we thank you for that. Um, you know, again, we would not have been able to pull together the Tricky Tray without your donation, so thanks. The program also lists restaurants and local businesses who donated baskets and gift cards to the Tricky Tray. Best way to thank them is to visit their stores or eat at their restaurants. Their generous donations allowed us to pull together some really nice baskets tonight. And then finally, a thank you to David's Bridals in Watchung and Adam's Fine Clothing and Tuxedo in New Providence for loaning us tuxes and dresses for tonight's show. We hope you will consider using their stores when buying or renting your prom wear this year. And I did want to do a quick shout out to the GL hockey team. Uh, they're starting their quest for their third state championship. Four hockey players had signed up to walk in the show tonight, but unfortunately they have a game starting probably in about an hour. Uh, so they had to drop out, but send them positive vibes and let's hope they get a win tonight. And similarly, our girls' swim team had a state tournament meet tonight, so we're also missing a couple of our female models, so we're hoping that these girls were victorious tonight as well. And now, without further ado, I'd like to introduce your MCs for tonight's fashion show. These two ladies were a tremendous help with, to Doreen and I in coordinating the fashion show piece of this evening. Please welcome Julia Hyman and Charlotte Kang. Hi everyone, welcome to Prom Fashion Show. Um, <laughs> thank you. 
Um, we want to thank you all for coming out to support Class of 2024. Um, and we hope you all got comfortable seats because we have quite a show for you today. Um, but we hope that you enjoy the show, and the show will begin shortly. We have Olivia and Jaden. Olivia hopes to study engineering or architecture in college. Her dream is to live in a penthouse in New York City and live a glamorous life. Jaden wants to major in finance in college. He likes to play basketball in his free time and is Italian, Cuban, and Chinese. Annalise and Bella. Annalise is an entrepreneur and runs her own hair business as a hairstylist. Yeah, Bella will be studying marketing in college and she loves shopping. I was standing side by side as a shadow crosses my what it takes to For Mac, Sophia, and Izzy. <laughs> Mac likes long walks, walks on the beach and playing lacrosse. His favorite food is Taylor ham, egg and cheese from Kraft Bagel. Sophia will be going to the University of South Carolina in the fall, where she'll be majoring in fashion, merchandising, and digital innovations. A fun fact about her is that she is a twin sister. Izzy is attending Marist College next year and will be studying communications. She's also on the GL girls lacrosse team and is looking forward to her senior season. Next up, we have Mackenzie and Aaron. Mackenzie will be attending. Mackenzie will be attending Ole Miss in the fall with a major in psychology. She has played soccer since she was four and works as a senior assisted living facility. Aaron will be attending University of Rhode Island, Fairfield, or Scranton, also for psychology.
Jackie and Sophie. Jackie loves being on stage and she dances and acts in her spare time. She's currently the dance captain of GL's upcoming spring musical, The Hello Girls, which you should all come see. But more importantly, Jackie wants you to know that her dog Clover is cuter than yours. Sophie does not know where she is going to college yet, but plans to go for musical theater. She has two dogs, two cats, and is one of five kids. She loves to tap dance with her friend Jackie and belt lyrics in the shower. Sydney will be attending Sacred Heart University for strategic communication, public relations, and advertising. Yeah. She yeah, also has a dog named Lynn. Betty now after the Taylor Swift song. Right next to the Nero, but I'll Carter will be attending Northeastern University in Boston this fall here, as an engineering major. Yeah, in his free time, he likes to listen to music, go to the, the city, and play with his dog right outside. His life goals are to travel the world and single-handedly solve climate change. Catch me in the kitchen like a Simmons whipping pastry. Cruising down A Street, off white Lexus. Driving so slow, but BK is from Texas. Me, I'm out there bed stop. Home of that boy Biggie Now I live on Billboard And I brought my boys with me Say what up to Tata Still sipping my top Sitting courtside Nicks and Nets give me high five I be spiked out I can trip a referee Tell by my attitude That I'm most Please welcome Abby and Tyler Abby has run varsity track All four years of high school She likes to bake, sew And has a pet rabbit Abby also has a macaron business, and let me tell you, they're delicious. Ty has run varsity tracks in sophomore year, enjoys skateboarding, and has a dog. I'm gonna give you my Give a warm welcome to Emily and John. <laughs> Emily will be attending Penn State where she plans on majoring in kinesiology. Emily is a defender for the GL girls lacrosse team and is super excited for her senior season. John is known for being chill and he enjoys football and basketball. His favorite movie characters are Zer Derek, Zoolander, and Austin Powers. Let's bring out all the models of Act One. We have Dan, Dylan, and Ian, Olivia and Jaden, Annalise and Bella, Max, Sophia, and Izzy, Mackenzie and Aaron, Jackie and Sophie, Sydney and Carter, Abby and Tyler, and Emily and John. Give it up for our Act One couples. We're going to pull the first 17 regular baskets, so just listen for your name, and if you win, you could go back and collect your basket near the uh, tricky tray tables. Uh, basket number one, Megan Ranitz. Hey! hey. <laughs> basket two, Tara Buckley. Basket three, Caitlin Escott. Basket four, Jordan Hyman. 
basket five, Jordan Hyman. Something's fixes in. Oh, man. Basket six, Rebecca Nappy. Basket seven, Sarah Jane Falso. <laughs> Basket eight, Virginia Delwart. Basket nine, I only have one name, Bermudez. Uh, basket 10, Melanie Davis. Basket 11, again, one name, Snyder. <laughs> Basket 12, Lily Durye. Basket 13, Danielle Naldi. Basket 14, Huli, H-O-U-L-I. Basket 15, Rebecca Nappy. Basket 16, Lori Weisenfeld. And basket 17, Gina Rich. University to study international business. She plays on the GL lacrosse team and is super excited for her senior season. Vicky loves hanging out with her friends and traveling. Blake likes to play soccer and on winter weekends he goes snowboarding. Blake also likes to have a good time with friends and has two dogs, Mally and Zeus. Next up, we have Theo, Harrison, and Maddie. Theo is a member of the GL fencing team. He also runs sound design for the Hilltop players and plays the trombone. Harrison is a member of the GL varsity fencing and tennis teams. He loves to play music and is looking forward to majoring in physical sciences. Maddie is currently a GL swim team captain. She loves to read and hopes to work in medical research. Natalie and Grace. Natalie is not committed to a school yet, but plans to major in finance and pursue a career as an actuary. I still have no idea what that is. She also loves music and reading. Grace will be studying public relations and advertising at Rowan University in the fall. Lila, Nicole, and Patrick. Lila will be attending Maris College in the fall and her dream vacation spot is Greece. Nicole will either be attending Coastal Carolina or University of South Florida. Patrick is a chill guy and enjoys playing basketball, watching movies, and hanging out with his friends. On the weekends, you may find Patrick at Blake's house. Patrick also takes lots of pride in upkeeping his car, a gray 2013 Honda CRV. Please welcome 
welcome Jess and Matt. Baby, are you down, Jess loves Taylor Swift and works at Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Matt's favorite sports to play and watch are football and baseball. In Matt's free time, he enjoys going to the gym and hanging out with friends. Give it up for Bianca, Kat, and Megan. Bianca plans on dyeing her hair red before college. Although she doesn't know where she's going for college, she plans on studying business and hopes to live out her dream of having a penthouse in New York City like Jesse. Kat will be attending Susquehanna University, and a fun fact about her is that she had a bunny for eight years. Megan plays lacrosse and field hockey. In college, she wants to study public policy, and her favorite food is a buffalo chicken pizza. Give it up for our next couple, Gabby and Ryan. Na, 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 na. Gabby plans to major in nursing throughout college and plays volleyball for GL and club. Ryan is an all-star lacrosse player and loves eating at La Rosa, especially their chicken Caesar wraps, and considers himself the best hockey manager GL has ever seen. I'm not for taking what I think I deserve, and you're overdue. And if you listen, you can hear me through the radio, in that bright white noise. Give a warm welcome to Vincent and Jack. Vincent loves the gym and Wawa, especially the classic hoagie. Jack is a student council president, a Wawa fiend, and also loves the gym. Let's have another round of applause for Jack and Vincent. Okay. Welcome. All right, welcome Danny and Logi. Danny wants to study film and television in college and loves all things guitars, cars, and rock and roll. a swimmer and works as a swim instructor. Give it up for Danny's performance. 
again. Next, next song. Oh, yeah. Oh. Let's bring out all of our Act 2 models. Give it up for Vicky and Blake, Theo Harrison and Maddie, Grace and Natalie, Lila, Nicole, and Patrick, Jess and Matt, Megan, Bianca, and Kat, Gabby and Ryan, Vincent and Jazz. Danny and Loji, give it up for our Act 2 models. I love you, I love you, I love you. I've been a lot of places all around the way. Yeah. I've seen a lot of joy and I've seen a lot of pain, but I don't want to write a love song for the world. I just want to write a song about a boy and a girl. Junkies on the corner always calling my name, and the kids on the corner playing ghetto games. When I saw you getting down, girl, I hope it was you. And when I look into your eyes, I knew it was true. All right, we're going to get, uh, we're going to pull the next 17 baskets. Uh, starting with basket 18, Jeannie Ruban. Basket 19, Beth Nikolic. Basket 20, Doreen Pitt. Basket 21, Ann Zucci, or Zuki. Basket 22, Rachel Mehta. 23, Jen Castrovinci. 24, Sylvia Sokolnicki. 25, Wendy Kakamo. 26, Gina Rich. 27, Gina Rich. Ah. 28, Cheryl Gillick. 29, Ed Kang. 30, Megan Fajardo. 31, I thought it was me, but it's Carolyn Bullard. Hmm. Uh, 32, Kelly Sheehan. 33, Annie Basile. And 34, Jason Vademan. Start this act off, please welcome our first couple, Ashlyn and Gabe. Ashlyn likes to run track and play soccer. A fun fact about Ashlyn is that she is really good at hula hooping. Gabe likes to spend his time skiing and playing soccer. A fun fact about Gabe is that if he didn't play soccer, he would be a hockey goalie. Savannah will be attending Rowan University. Cameron will be attending Coastal Carolina University with an undecided major. Julia has been a competitive dancer for 14 years. She dances five times a week and mentors young children in dance on the weekends. A fun fact about Julia is that she has two cats even though she's allergic to them. Arisa is a tennis team captain and enjoys going out with friends. Shawty got that super thing, I didn't listen to the sound for Spain. Got me soon as I walk through the door. Oh, my pockets started tickling, the way she dropped it low, that 
that thing Got me one to spend my money on her She get it poppin' like it, droppin' that birthday cake Got a candle, need to blow that crazy flame I take my red back, cut up my jewelry Shawty, it's cool like Please welcome Rebecca and Catherine Rebecca is captain of GL's varsity fencing team. She plans to study psychology in college and hopes to become a clinical psychologist in the armed forces. Catherine is a manager for the GL swim team and hopes to become a physical therapist. Next up, we have Carly and Will, who have been dating for three years. People dream high in the quiet of the night. You know Carly plans on studying it. psychology in college to become a child psychologist. Will is the captain of the basketball team and also plays lacrosse. He is undecided for college but plans on studying business. Give a round of applause for Julie and Sarah. Okay, Julie will be attending college in the fall for television production. She's also a lighting designer for the Hilltop players. Julie loves to read and listen to Taylor Swift. Sarah is a part of the GL swim team and the track team. She plans on majoring in either food science or biomedical engineering. Sarah also enjoys baking in her free time. to 22 different countries around the world and was born on Mother's Day. She is going to college to major in fashion marketing. Odebeck does judo and is a member of the Mountainside Fire Department. She plays basketball and is in theater. She's in GL Lusando and will be majoring undecided in college. Maya is the chat to Carolyn's Troy Bolton and she is also in the school's a cappella group and is a proud member of the GL Hilltop Players. Maya plans to major in marketing and minor in theater when she goes to college. Olivia is recently committed to High Point University. In her free time, she likes to shop and go to the gym. Her favorite color is pink, and her prized possession is her digital camera. Oh, what is 
in Spanish. Wyatt is fascinated with things that to the average person are extremely dangerous. If there's something that can kill him, he probably wants to do it. In his spare time, Wyatt also enjoys getting absolutely wrecked in every sport he plays. She's on fire, she's so hot, she's come no lies, she burn up the spots, look like Mariah, I took another shot, she told her, drop, 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 drop it like it's hot, dirty talk, dirty dance, she a freaky girl, and I'm a freaky man, she on the rebound, broke up with an ex, and I'm like Rodman, ready on deck, I told her I wanna ride out, and she said, yes, we didn't go to church, but I got, I know my was gonna be Next up, we have Liv and Brett. Liv has two dogs and has been to five different countries and loves Chipotle. Brett plays the cross and loves LeBron James and Star Wars. models. First up, we have Ashlyn and Gabe, Savannah and Cameron, Julia and Arisa, Rebecca and Catherine, Carly and Will, Julia and Sarah, Ariana and Odebeck, Maya and Carolyn. But together we be the perfect soul. Olivia and Wyatt. Talk to me, girl. And Liv and Brett. Give it up for our act three models. to call the last regular basket winners, starting with basket 35, Jill Quigley, 36, Virginia DeVart, or DeHart, number 37, Nancy Tyson, 38, Sue Sabatino, 39, actually me, I finally won something, Woo <laughs> 40, Tom Rich, these riches, they're going home rich tonight, to tell you. Um, 41, Terry Giordano. 42, Virginia Delwart, again. Uh, 43, Paula Ortiz. 44, Terry Giordano, again. 45, Gina Rich. I know. 46, Elisa Rowland. 47, Jean uh, Kingsley. 48, Jennifer Aponte. 49, Vicky Baum. 50, Kevin Ryan, I think. Kerry Ryan, Kerry, sorry, Kerry Ryan. 51, Lynn Diaco, or Diaco. And 52, Sarah Gleason. And just before we get started on the um, fourth act and final act of models, I did just want to give a quick um, update that tonight we raised almost $9,000 for project graduation. I know, I, I just heard we need that. And just a reminder that the freshmen, or these seniors did not fundraise at all freshman year because of COVID. So, you know, every dollar we raise today, they really need to, you know, for their prom, to defray the cost of prom and for that, it, it's a really cool um, event, project graduation. So about $8,800, $8, not $88,000, $8,800 raised tonight. So thank you all for your generous donations. Wait, 
Miss France, can you go get Miss Climates? Just tell her because she has to announce it after. She has to stand here because she has to announce stuff after us. Okay. Ready? Ready? Are you bored yet? Well, good thing this is our last act. To start off, Act Four. We have Haley and Landon. Haley participated in the school volleyball program for all four years. She's not committed to a college yet, but loves dressing up. Landon is committed to Northeastern University, and his major is going to be computer science and computer engineering. Landon has three dogs and one bird, and in his free time, he likes to play guitar. Next up, we have Sammy, yeah, Natalie, and Morgan. Sammy has been running track and cross country all four years of high school and plans to major in marketing in college. Natalie enjoys listening to music, reading, and going to the beach. Her favorite food is a craft bagel. Morgan is planning on studying political science on a pre-law track in college. She's the vice president of GL's Junior Statesman of America, and she is heavily involved in many service-oriented clubs at GL. Welcome our next couple, Mia and JJ. Mia is attending Loyola University, Maryland, and is committed to their track and field program. Congrats, Mia. She is majoring in their pre-physician's assistant program. She enjoys hobbies such as traveling, hiking, cooking, and going to the beach. JJ is looking to further his education into the construction field. JJ likes to hang out with his friends and his girlfriend Mia. He also enjoys outdoor activities and barbecues. Next up, we have Sarah and Patrick. It's hard to yell when the bat rails in your mouth. Sarah is not committed to a college yet. But her top three schools are Penn State, Virginia Tech, and Indiana. She has been on varsity basketball team for four years and the varsity soccer for three. When she's older, Sarah plans to be involved in the sports media world for a professional sports team. Patrick will be attending Lehigh University and enjoys playing football and lacrosse. Roof on the back down. I'm on the road doing shows from a Mac down. Mississippi to Philly, Albuquerque to Chat Town. Give it up for Brianna and Anthony. Brianna plans on majoring in psychology in college, and in her free time, she likes to coach the local girls' softball team. She also likes to read books and go to the beach. Anthony has plans to become a New Jersey State Trooper. In his free time, he loves working on his car and motorcycles in his garage with his father. Please welcome Brenna and Henry. Brenna loves singing in her free time and has been since she was three. She also loves going to the beach and tanning. 
Henry's favorite band is The Grateful Dead, and he is a big college basketball fan. Dancing in the flow, yes, I feel it's my time. Watch me glow, living in the dream lights, in the zone. Yeah, this world is all mine, come see what you'll find, right? Next up, we have Dylan and Matthew. Easy no, no need to go down. Rock that run, that this how we from. Dylan plays Easy soccer no, no and likes down. to work out with D1 baseball players. Easy no, no need to go down. Matthew will be Rock playing D1 baseball at the College of William and Mary and loves weekends with the boys. and will be majoring in business at Virginia Tech in the fall. Charlotte spends her time going on runs outside, working at Nagoya, and petting her dogs, Brune and Phoenix. Julia plans to study chemical engineering in college at either Illinois or Wisconsin. She loves working at her local pizza place and playing soccer. Currently, Julia is training for a Spartan race and can't wait for what the rest of senior year brings. And let's bring out all of the Act 4 models. We have Haley and Landon, Sammy, Natalie, and Morgan, Where it began. Mia and JJ, I can't begin. Sarah and Patrick, but then I know Brianna and Anthony, strong. Brenna and Henry. Was in the spring. Dylan and Matthew. And spring became the summer. Ava and Michael. Who'd have you'd come and finally Charlotte and Julia. Hand, touching hand. Reaching out. Touching me. Touching me. to announce the grand prize winners. So grand prize winner number one, Terry Giordano. Grand prize number two, Jennifer Rinaldi. Number three, Rob Zecca. Number four, Jeannie Ruban. Number five, Marie Cortez. Six, Kelly Sheehan. Seven, Stephanie Schwartz. Eight, Dorothy Zakaracha. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Dorada. 
Number nine, Annie Basile. Number 10, Nina Coulter. Number 11, Elisa Rollins. Number 12, Vicki Casuda. Number 13, Doreen Pitt. And number, I'm sorry, 13, Doreen Pitt. Number 14 is Jean Kingsley. And I just want to thank you all for coming out this evening and for your generous support tonight. Congratulations to all our lucky winners in the Tricky Tray. And thank you to our senior models. You all looked fantastic and did a great job. And before everybody starts to go, I just want to have everybody give Carolyn a big thanks. She's a true volunteer. Her son wasn't even in the show tonight, and she did all this for our kids and for a prom. So thank her when you see her.